Many congratulations to all of you who've won these awards today. It is a tremendous achievement. Placement is just so important to us because it means that we're connected in with the industry. And when you're out there, you're acting as our ambassadors. And how wonderful it is to see the fact that across the range of courses that we operate, we have such great ambassadors working on behalf of Harper Adams out there in the sectors that we work closely with. I was with Backable on placement, which is a leading manufacturer of um, fresh prepared produce. So I was in two different placements. The first one was at Wingland Foods, Sutton Bridge, and they make the salads for Waitrose. So I was project based while I was there. So one of the first projects was I was visiting the different growers um, to do with some policies that Waitrose had brought out. And then I was on another um, project which was more commercial based. And then I moved over to Bourne Salads, where I worked in new product development. Um, so spent seven months there uh, developing new stir fries and fruit salads for M&S. Yeah, I had a fab time on placement, really enjoyed it, flown by so quickly. But no, it was a really worthwhile year, so I really enjoyed it. I'm hopefully going to go back to Backable in a new product development role, so I'm going to speak to them soon to do a job opportunity, so hopefully, yeah, go back there and be developing salads for Waitrose, hopefully. It's really good. Um, I didn't know there was like such an award available, so when I got the email through, I'd won something that was brilliant. I was on a family run hill farm. It was 300 head dairy herd and 700 head flock of sheep. Did all sorts of milking, lambing, the usual jobs, and there was contracting business as well. So plenty of tractor driving alongside that. So. Yeah, it was really good and I think the thing I enjoyed the most was milking because I'd done no previous milking before, nothing to do with dairy cows. So that was my best bit. Yeah, I'm happy. I'm surprised. Yeah, I didn't, uh, I didn't think I'd be in for a while, but no, I was, I was happy to receive it. Yeah. I was on Athel Estates in Perthshire. Um, it's a 145,000 acre estate, so it's quite, quite a big estate. Um, I was mainly office based, um, doing land management and applying for grants. Uh, but also as part of the estate, I got out there on the estate and um, worked alongside deer stalkers and the farm staff, which gave me a good experience. So yeah, I really enjoyed myself there. But, yeah, I really enjoyed the placement. I was given the opportunity to work as a part of the team on the estate, uh, given quite a lot of responsibility. Um, also given the opportunity to work as uh, the rural manager um, due to um, one, of the, one of the members of staff leaving. So that gave me a brilliant opportunity to do things that I wouldn't have done. So yeah, I really enjoyed myself, yeah. I've got a, a job in Scotland, so doing land management, um, which involves uh, estates all across Scotland and doing, doing uh, all sorts of jobs, so it's, it's interesting. I worked at Shelburne Reynolds Engineering in Suffolk, uh, working with the design engineers. Uh, I was a student design engineer, designing and modifying existing products for their global engineering enterprise. Yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed placement. It gave me a great uh, experience into what the working world would be like after graduating. Um, I really enjoyed it, the work that I was doing, the people that I was working with, and I'd very much like to go back and do that kind of job in the future. I'm After leaving Harper, I am going back to Street Hall Estate, working as a general farm worker for this summer and then looking at gaining more experience with a New Zealand style harvest uh, over this coming winter period. It was a nice surprise actually, um, it was just really, it was a bit of a shock but it was really good. Nice to know I've done well. <laughs> I went to work for Avigen which is a poultry breeding company and I spent nine months in Edinburgh and then went to Stratford upon Avon for a bit and then went to Australia for another five and a half months. I kind of worked between all the different departments so I did some laboratory work, um, just general routine tests that they carry out on a week, weekly basis and uh, sort of management of poultry, how the hatchery works and I was related it to sort of uh, production and trying to increase production of chicks and stuff so it was quite good, did a couple of projects and yeah I really enjoyed it. I never thought I'd work with poultry before so it was a nice experience. Um, the best part probably working in the labs and being given the freedom of doing two projects because uh, it made me have to use my brain quite a lot and work out budgets which is not something I've had to do before and I got a lot of um, support from the company which was quite nice but I felt like I got something out of it so it was really good. I'd like to go back to university for four more years to do veterinary science to then specialise as a poultry vet 
air because there yeah. would be something I'm really interested in and I've always wanted to be a vet and I like working with chickens so I thought why not.